It's usually very good. Ah, uh, thirds? No, thanks. I'm full. That was a great meal. Well, go on, then. The stars are out. Thank you, Mrs Kearney. <laughs> I think she's got a convert. <laughs> and I'll need someone for the dishes. Well, I'll uh, go and call her back, shall I? Ah... Uh... starch and high in energy. But the group looking at chick death has found that hyperlepus isn't the balanced diet needed to bring the birds into breeding position. I've oh, got the kid under wraps tonight. No, I just don't want to see him getting into any trouble. I'm sure. Listen, if we sell our rights together, we can really up the price. Yes, and maybe drive the swamp. Uh, maybe not. We've got to keep the interests of the town at heart. I know where your heart is, Mitch. In your money box. Never had vandals before. seeing it so close. That's Beta Cracks, one of the stars of the Southern Cross. If I wanted to go there, I'd be travelling 500 years at the speed of light. Next century's going to be all about space exploration. Is that what you want to do? Well, the moon, then the planets. As far as I can go. The stars? Too far away. Come on, I'll show you something. What? Over here. Hey! Look, the rest of the dirt's come off. Just in that jar. Here. Now watch this. Careful. I'm watching. They do move. I made them this morning. Okay. I did. Hey, pass me the screwdriver. The last time I did this, I flipped it in my hand. It's not as though I've touched something sensitive. Is it breathing? It's not funny. I touched those blades. On all I did, they were power cuts. Just thank you, Mito. Blades didn't turn. They did for me. And the power stopped because of it, I'm sure.
There's a pet in here. Another look at the telescope. Do you think they're making all this up? I don't know. My bike ran onto that thing as though it was guided. And the Daisy Road was spinning last night and calling my name. You said that was a dream. It wasn't a dream. Look, my uncle's coming soon. Let's leave it till morning. Then we'll work it out together, okay? She's right, thanks. Engine cut. She just went in. Just like that? Yeah, lights went. Couldn't see a thing. They OK now? Yeah, yeah, I'll check them in the morning. Thanks for stopping, mate. OK. See ya. See you, mate. I wish I had something like this. Two thousand bucks. One of those let's keep it quiet gifts. <laughs> That's how I got my bike. Well, you must be going to Canada for a year. I've got this. Anyway, I'll be at boarding school most of the time. Um, you mentioned Sirius. Where is that? There. I wonder if anyone's looking back. They might be on Sirius. There's all sorts of funny legends. Spacemen. Aliens from outer space come into Earth. That sort of thing. Yeah? It's just stories. There's no proof. It sure is bright. The brightest star in the sky. Sirius. Watchdog of the forests. Huh? Sirius comes out from behind the sun in January. The time of the eel migration. Did you know about the stars? Our people had to. We navigated by them. We knew the Earth was round long before Columbus. How? There's more to knowledge than science. Thanks for looking after Ronnie. Our pleasure. What do you mean, there's more to knowledge than science? Well, look at it this way. If we knew the Earth was round long before you, that puts us, wanna? <laughs> <laughs> I think Mr. Kepper meant more. Life is more than facts and figures. I have an answer ready tomorrow. <laughs> Bedtime. I'll just stick this back. Tucked up. Um, I won't be a moment. Now what? I just want to check something. It won't be too long now.
Hansen. Oh, so a lie up there. In the swamp. A torch? No. Just a lot of some sort. A funny colour, too. Not bad, eh? Gretchen found it in the barn. Mm. She and Ronnie spent most of the day there. Well, it's good they found each other. She's all right. Mm. It's hard to believe she's only 12. Well, the world's changed a bit since we were kids. Not so much of the we. Move, love. No, don't move. I'm all right. Just a bit winded, that's all. You sure? You fell from up there. It wasn't like falling. You'd better come straight inside. What's this about? Oh, um, dinosaurs. Makes a change from birds. They're very small dinosaurs. Probably evolved into birds. Oh. Look, I know this hasn't been much of a holiday for you, but, um, well, we shouldn't be here too much longer. Selling. When I was your age, I had nothing. I'm not going to let that happen to you. Why not something else? Oh, what do you think? Poultry farming, maybe. Hmm. Give you plenty of birds to watch. It's a joke, Bevis. Mrs. Elliot. Just to say, we've been keeping an eye on the site. In case you know who comes back. Yes, well, thanks very much, but I think we can let the police handle this, don't you? Good night, Martha. Uh, Bevis. Only trying to help, Mrs. Elliot. Perhaps you'd uh, like a little something in the bar. Oh, no, 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 thanks. Thanks all the same, though. No. <laughs> You don't see this many in town. The city shuts out a lot of things. Come on, I'll show you something. They go back a long, long way. 1840. Your great-grandfather Went to England and met Queen Victoria. Learned English on the way and French, just in case. 1840. He was the first to put our history down on paper. All the legends. Papa, Papa. Hey, that's my name. Of course, your family. 
I can't read, Mary. Well, then, ask someone to teach you. Would you? First lesson. How do you get them away? Huh? Go to bed. Here. Thanks. Never take chances like that again. We're responsible for you. I'd never forgive myself if anything happened to you. I didn't hurt myself. You know, you do take this space business very seriously. There's life down here, too. I'm sorry to be a nuisance. Oh, you're not. Not at all. Uh, I was playing Ludo at your age. I'm trying to isolate a design I copied. It could be part of a chemical equation. Hmm. Constellations. Mm, that's Ronnie and his men from Mars. I'm going to tell them the legend of Sirius. There's a tribe in Africa called the Dogon. They told explorers that space creatures came to Earth from a small star that orbits around Sirius. Thousands of years ago. They even had rock drawings. But the explorers thought it was all legends and nonsense because there was no such star. Mm. And who was right? The Dogon were. We didn't even photograph it till 1970. They knew exactly where it was. Hundreds of years before the telescope was invented. Here. There's a picture of it. It's called Sirius B. Mm. And you've made a copy of it. Is that for Ronnie? Anyway, good night. Good night. been staring me in the face all this time. she swallowed it. Sure. But nothing tonight. Tomorrow. And we'll uh, leave these behind. They'll blame it on the kid.
Yes, I'm all right. Just a bad dream. <laughs>